a lot of people say, you know, a lot of people are looking at what Giannis is doing and still, oh, well, he still can't shoot or he still doesn't have a three or he still airballs air balls free throws. He still airballs three pointers, which is which is true. That's that is that is true. Giannis cannot shoot to save his life. Or let me say Giannis is, is not a good shooter at all from the free throw line outside of t- like outside of the paint. He's not good. But I think that a lot of people gloss over what he is good at. I mean, a man that can't shoot threes is still giving you consecutive 40 point games. It hasn't been done in the final since Shaq. A man that can't shoot is still getting damn near a block and a half a game in these playoffs. Like, no, Giannis can't shoot, and and Giannis needs to improve that if he wants to if he wants to round out his game. But let's not let's not overlook what he can do and what he has been doing. Giannis has been doing things again. Giannis. You know, the thing that hurts Giannis, in my opinion, is one, the I guess the, the other superstars in the league, there's nobody like Giannis in this league. If you look at the other, I guess, top 10 players, you know, uh, KD is not like Giannis. Kawhi is not like Giannis. Steph, LeBron, A, uh, you know, AD, Jokic, Joel Embiid. Um, there's no other player like Giannis. So it's kind of hard to give him a comp. Or... People want to give him a comp so bad, but you give him the wrong comp. He's nothing like KD. Yeah, maybe the the body type, I, I mean, the height, not the body type. The height is like KD, but that's about it. KD operates a different part of the floor than Giannis. He's nothing like Steph, nothing like Dame, nothing like uh, James Harden, nothing like Kyrie. He's nothing like these players. So when you look, it's kind of like, you know what it is? And, and don't, I'm not comparing them at all. But it's kind of like the Tim Duncan and Kobe effect. Everybody wants to praise Kobe, which, again, it's right to praise Kobe. But everybody wants to praise Kobe. E- you know, people say he's easily top 10. Hell, people have – there's people that have Kobe best player of all time, and there's nothing wrong with, like, if that's how you feel, that's how you feel. But those same people will say, Tim Duncan, don't you ever put Tim Duncan in the same conversation as Kobe. But Tim Duncan has accomplished the same exact amount of things that Kobe has outside of scoring. Kobe's de- game was extremely different from Giannis' game. I mean, no, from from Tim Duncan's game. And they both dominated two different parts of the floor, but they both are dominant players. And people will nitpick and say Tim Duncan wasn't that great because he didn't jump. I mean, he didn't shoot or could score as great as Kobe Yet and still, Tim Duncan was an all-time great. Giannis cannot do everything that KD can do, everything that James Harden can do, everything that Steph can do, everything that, I don't know, man, everything that these superstar, other superstars can do, yet and still, he still dominates in his way. 